I had heard about Hillel as a Jewish organization for college students and I was really missing that part of my life of actively expressing my Judaism. So I went on campus and I searched out for the table during the first weeks of school and I finally found it. I got lost on the campus several times first though. And I came to a first educational experience and I went to a Shabbat dinner and I was just astounded by the warmth and how welcoming everyone was. It was a place where I knew I wanted to be and a place where I knew I wanted to start creating memories. My freshman year, my first year at San Jose State, um, I came to the opening event to see what, what Hill is all about and then I never went to another Hill event for the entire year. My second year, so my sophomore year, is when I started, I decided to get back into the whole Judaism, Jewish culture, Jewish identity. Um, so I started coming back to Hillel, I started coming to the events, I started the, the fall, what was it, 20, 2012 events, um, when they were hosting things for, for all students to come and meet other Jewish people on campus. But my experiences at Hillel have always felt like I've been part of a larger Jewish community, how, I've, how it fits in the one little piece of a bigger puzzle. Well, the spark that really got me hooked on Hillel wasn't really any one experience. However, it was a multitude of experience, um, especially my first Shabbat dinner. And everyone went around and said their name and their school and what they were studying. What it really showed me was how many memories were being built in this place. And I wanted to start making those memories. I've done many, many things since I've been here at Hillel. Um, I recently started an initiation for leading Shabbat services here, which we now do every other Shabbat. Um, I have been the co-president of the Jewish Student Union of my campus, and I've just been part of lots of activities and participated in other events. I've done Habitat for Humanity work. I've worked on um, various cleanup days, um, breast cancer walks. Anything that I can possibly attend, I do. It was probably AE Pi, uh, Alpha Epsilon Pi, the Jewish fraternity on at San Jose State, Kai Sai, so that's our chapter. We get very involved with the Hillel's activities, events, helping them promote uh, is pro-Israel, pro-Judaism events on campus whenever we can. So be being a part of AE Pi really, really started making me realize how great the, the, the Silicon Valley Hillel really is. I think that there are more values of being part of Hillel than I can possibly count. For me personally, having a safe and welcoming and warm Jewish place to go at any time that I want to is really important to me. Also having, you know, as silly as it sounds, a place where you can get really good food. <laughs> having, you know, those Shabbat leftovers that were just so delicious is really amazing. I went on birthright because of, uh, because of this Hillel here. I went on a, a Silicon Valley birthright trip with uh, other people from the area. That sort of inspired me to go and see as much of the world as possible because just going, going to Israel for my first time with the uh, people I knew in the, in, in the area was a really great experience and I, m I made a lot of good friends for life. What that's inspired me to do is not only just to keep good relations with other people, especially Jew the Jewish community, but also to explore the world and find, try and find all those little nooks and crannies of Judaism all around and try and apply that to my daily life. I really hope that in 20 years, we've all raised more awareness of all of the different colors of Judaism. And I hope that as Hillel and um, the global Jewish community gets more involved, that we raise awareness and acceptance of all Jews as a people. The one thing I love about Judaism and Jewish culture itself is more of the set of moral codes and rules that advise their day-to-day -day life. Um, studies from the Talmud, from the, from the Torah, they all have to do with, the, with diligence, hard work, uh, education. These, these ideals I think are really important to like, the development of, of, of successful people. It has, it has a lot to do with um, just being dedicated and not, and not straying away from that path.